guys, I'm back. In today's video, I'm doing a hair care routine thing. So, I just got out of the shower and <clears throat> piece of hair that was on my tongue. But I got in the shower and I washed my hair with this VO VO5 shampoo. Then the with the um this VO5 passion fruit smoothie conditioner these work really well together and these smell really good so i washed my hair now i'm about to go ahead and get this wide tooth comb and start detangling it and i detangle in the shower while the conditioner is in my hair because that's the really easy way to detangle too so now, after, you know, I detangled my hair, it's really poofy now, so I'm about to go ahead and just put this regular water in my hair, um, because it makes it really easy to put in products. So after my hair sprayed really good, then I'm gonna go ahead and take this whole bit, whole blends leave-in conditioner and put some in my hair. Here it's the um, coconut oil and cocoa butter one. And it smells really good. So then you know you put it in the palm of your hand, and I use about that much, and I just put put it all in my hair. And another question I get asked, oh, well, questions I get asked is how often do I wash my hair? I, like, it de it depends. Like, if my hair feels greasy, I'll wash it. But, like, if it needs to be, like, re-moisturized or something, I won't use shampoo. I'll just wash it with conditioner. And then sometimes I'll wait, like, two weeks to wash my hair. Because my hair doesn't need to get washed that much. But whenever my hair was short, oh, it had to get washed a lot. Sometimes I'll wash my hair twice a week. Sometimes it's once a week. Sometimes it's once every two weeks. So after you put it all in your hair, then you want to go ahead and distribute it, distribute it through by just combing it out again. <sighs> Alright, so after you do that, then you want to go ahead and part your hair. Um, I usually go for a middle part. No, a middle part, a side part. Because... I don't know. But usually sometimes I won't even do a part. Whenever it dries, I'll just put it up in a ponytail or a bun or something. Because I do not want to deal with it. Whenever I leave my hair out, that's when it um, gets like tangly and dry. So I don't want that. Then to top everything off, I'm going to go ahead and use this Cantu Shea Butter um, to find the Shine Custard. The difference between custards and gels are custards are way more thinner than gels. Here, I'm about to show you. As you can see, that's very thin. Um, I like using gels in the summer and custards in the winter because I don't really know there's not like a why I just pref prefer to do it that way because gels they're gonna weigh down your hair and I like when my hair is weighed down in the summer because like I'll wear wash and goes in the summer all the time take a little bit more here put it Distribute it throughout my hands and go ahead. 
Now with custards, with the custard I'm using now, it doesn't form a gel cast. Like, you know how your hair gets like crunchy? My hair doesn't, it's not gonna do that because it's a custard. Then we're gonna go ahead and comb it one more time. Get that through all your and go ahead and uh, play with it a little bit. Another thing is, I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy me some mousse and just kind of help it. And that's my wash and go, people call them. But um, then I just let my hair air dry. I don't diffuse or anything. And yeah, and that's how I get defined curls. Um, oh, and I forgot to mention about this product is I made my own product by using the battle. I um took like I used it up halfway, then I filled the rest up with castor oil and a little bit of regular conditioner, and it definitely does work. Um, castor oil it helps grow out your hair. And that's what I've been using. So give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below what other videos you would like to see. Peace.